This video is about the replacement of the rubber bushings in the transport logs of a Biogram 4000 series turntable. For more information, please visit my blog at biolover.blogspot.com or go to my website at www.biolover.com. This here shows one of the transport logs of the Biogram. Essentially, we have a bolt that has two counter threaded parts and each of these threads catches one of the washers, one up here, one down, and so by turning this here counterclockwise the upper washer is moved down and the bottom washer is moved up and that locks the chassis into place. Now the chassis is dampened by a rubber bushing that is here between these washers. And so you see here this rubber bushing is completely disintegrated. Here's a photo after I took the transport lock apart and so here you see that old uh, rubber bushing completely hardened and uh, uh, basically crumbling. So this is not stamping anymore. And so I uh, designed replacement parts that I printed on a 3D laser lithography printer. And these printers they uh, print a pliable and very smooth plastic so which is perfect to replace a rubber bushing. I printed it in two parts so one can conveniently just put in one part from the bottom and one part from the top and they are just barely wider than the uh, orifice in the chassis so they make a press fit that holds them in place. Here you see the printer that I used. It's a Form 1 made by Form Labs. So that's a stereo lithography printer. So with two lasers, um, a resin is hardened and uh, the uh, printed part comes out hanging down uh, from this plate. And so here you see the plate that contains those uh, six rubber bushing parts. And they were actually printed on rafts, as they, as they call it, so it's easier to remove them from this platter because these bottom parts here are, uh, these discs are fairly thin. It can get a little bit confusing putting the uh, transport logs back together because of the reversely uh, threaded bolt, so I made a little video about it. The first uh, step is to put in these washers. Now it is time to put the new bushings in. And now the bolt. So the longer part uh, goes downwards and so I put it in one turn and now I put the top washer on one turn. It's important that top and bottom have the same turns uh, when you assemble this because of course one wants that these washers move symmetrically when the transport log is engaged. At this point it's good to engage the transport lock. That makes it easier to put these bolts in. It can be difficult to get these bolts back in, so what I do in this case is put a little bit of silicone grease at the end.
And you see now it goes in smoothly. That's pretty much it. Now we can open the transport lock and the gas is, is uh, free to move again. That's it. This concludes my video about the replacement of rubber bushings in the transport locks in a Biogram 4000 series turntable. Thanks for watching.